Hi guys! Um, just want to say sorry for not making a video for what seems like absolute ages. Um, the battery in my camera died completely, wouldn't charge up, and I've not got the money to pay the full price for it, so I had to wait to find one on eBay for a decent price, and now it's finally here so I can make videos again. Um, there'll be a few more videos coming over the next couple of weeks because I'm off work for the Christmas holidays, so I'll be around a lot more which is good and I'll like do an update video and stuff um, next week for you. Um, today I'm going to do the Holly Jolly tag which is a Christmas tag. Um, I found it on Rachel's page which is Rachelkins I believe is her name. She's awesome. Um, I'll put her link below because she's like really good, good. If you like like makeup and girly bits you'll love her. Um, I will read the questions which are on my laptop here which is why I'm looking down. Um, sorry my phone's flashing. And then I will answer them the best I can. So, question one. What's your favourite Christmas movie? I can't choose just one. I love Christmas films. I watch Christmas films all throughout the year because I'm really cool. Um, my favourites are Home Alone 2, Miracle on 34th Street, um, Christmas with the Cranks, and Deck the Halls are probably my four favourites. Um, yeah, I guess them four. Next question, are you on the naughty or nice list? I think I'm on the nice list. I've been pretty good this year, to be honest. Been quite nice with the people. Um, I've done my fair bit for charity. And I've just been an all-around good person, I think. That's my personal opinion on it. Um, show your cheesiest Christmas card. I haven't put any up. They're all at work. I'm really sorry, I can't do that. Um, have you ever had a white Christmas? Not here in England but I went to my cousins in Boston when I was five we had like five foot of snow we couldn't get out it was amazing and to me that was like the best thing that could ever happen because I actually got to experience a white Christmas um where are your holidays spent um it differs from year to year um last Christmas me and my boyfriend stayed at our flat and his mum came over but this Christmas we're going to my parents which is like five minutes down the road um, and my auntie's coming and then my two cousins are coming up from Eastbourne which is like down the coast um, near Brighton if you don't even know um, so that's going to be really really nice so it's me at my parents house um, play or sing your favourite Christmas song do I have to really I'll sing you a line of a song I'll look like Rudolph the red nosed reindeer had a very shiny nose there you are. That's a favourite Christmas song. Get over it. I'm really embarrassed. Um, the next one. Do you open your Christmas presents on Christmas Eve? No. It's all about Christmas Day. If I open on Christmas Eve, Christmas Day would just be like out of routine for me because we like have breakfast. We come down early because I'm such a child. Come down early. We have breakfast. We go into the front room, open presents from each other. Then have dinner, and then later on we open like other family presents and friends presents and stuff. So, no. Do you know all of Santa's reindeer? Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donna, Blitzen and Rudolph. Any holiday traditions? We always play board games on Christmas Day evening. Um, and we always have scrambled egg and sausages for breakfast. My cat's gone mad, she's hanging around down here, I apologise if you can hear her shaking her toy. Um, what else do we do? Everyone has to be dressed and downstairs before we can go in the front room where the presents are. Um, that's it really. Like games and certain food and stuff I guess. Um, is your tree real or fake? Well, I still count my, I don't know why, because I've lived with my parents, which I'm not, I've lived away for two years. Um, mine and Matt's tree is fake and it's got um, like flashing lights in it and it's really cool. And my mum's tree is real, but I say it's my tree still because I still get to pick the Christmas tree. We go hunting for the Christmas tree and I get to choose it, so I still say it's my tree. Um, what's your favourite holiday food and or treat? I just like a good old roast dinner because I'm too lazy to cook the most of the time. So a proper Christmas dinner is amazing. I love turkey. Um, and I really like mince pies, so it's like the only time of year I get my mince pies. Um, do you like giving or receiving gifts better? Giving, definitely. Um, I love seeing people's faces when they open presents, you got them like things you didn't expect. 
um yeah obviously everyone likes to receive gifts but i think giving you get you feel really nice if someone really loves what you got them show your tacky christmas attire i've not got any tacky christmas attire i'm really disappointed in myself i'm not like looking around for stuff i'm really sorry that i've disappointed you i have however got like a pink santa hat and it's a santa baby across like the front fur bit but that's in my bag that's all work so I'm sure I'll put it on in a video within the next week to show you. <laughs> What's your dream place to spend the holidays? Somewhere really cold and really snowy because that's just how Christmas should be. Like in all the films, it always snows on Christmas. And like it's supposed to snow like this week to next week in England or where I am anyway. And it would be so nice just to wake up to snow on Christmas Day. So anywhere with snow would be good. Um, do you have any holiday recipes? Um, not really, I sort of, like, I made Christmas dinner last year, which was really scary, by the way, and, like, I just go with what it says on the thing, so I didn't even think, like, on the packet, I didn't even think exciting there. I do always make mince pies, like, me and my mum make the mince meat, and then we put it in phyllo pastry, um, and then you, like, sort of wrap it up like a bag, and it's, like, a little bag like this, and it's really cute, and they're quite yummy. So I guess that's my sort of recipe. Other than that, I really like making chocolate pretzels at Christmas. I don't know why, that's really weird, but I do. And I like making mint hot chocolate, which you crush candy canes in um, hot chocolate. It's awesome. Do that, do that, it's good. Are you good at wrapping presents or do you fail? I'm really good at wrapping things that are in boxes. If they're not in a box, it's an epic fail. You don't want to see my wrapping, it's appalling. Um, how or when did you find out the truth about Santa? I don't know what you're talking about. I still believe in Santa. But on a whole, like, truthfully I do. I'm such a child. Um, I found out in year seven, which is really late, which I was like, what, 11? And I know that it's like really late for people, but I'm an only child, so I didn't kind of have the older part, like, sibling to like, nag me about it and say, oh, blah, blah, he's not real. So every time I heard people say he wasn't real, I sort of like let it go over my head because as I said, I'm like the biggest child in the world. So 11, nearly 12, because my birthday's just after Christmas. So I was nearly 12 and there was me and this other guy in my class who like refused to believe that Father Christmas wasn't real. Um, but then our teacher told us and was like, well, no, he's not real and you need to stop believing because you're going to secondary school next year. I was really disappointed because, do you know what, my cousins told me the year before that they saw Father Christmas leave their next door neighbour's roof with all the reindeer and it was the most amazing thing ever. And to this day, I still hate them for that because I was like so excited that my cousin saw Father Christmas and I didn't get to see him, but you know... Oh, it's crap. I really wish it was real because it'd be like the most cool thing in the world ever. <laughs> I'm sorry, my god, I'm such a child, aren't I? Any New Year's resolutions? Um, well, I've been on a diet sort of thing since October and I've lost two stone. So I'd like to sort of carry on with that but not think of it as a diet because I don't feel like I'm dieting. I'm just like weighing out my portions and doing it that way. So I'd like to carry on with that because I, it's my best friend's wedding next August and she lives in Cyprus. So she's getting married on a beach and I'd like to be like a little bit skinny. Not, not skinny, I wouldn't look good skinny. I'd like to drop like two dress sizes and I think I'd be quite happy with how I looked then. Not that I'm not happy now, you know, I'm curvy. That's me, I've always been curvy. But I'd like to drop a couple of dress sizes, so I think I might carry on with that. And it says, do you stick with your news resolutions? Well, I'm going to do it with this one because I've got something to aim for. And I've got like another eight months to go. So hopefully I can use a few stone by then, which would be really cool. And what makes a holiday special for you? Um, just being with my family and like having the time off work. Like obviously when you're at school, you get time off for Christmas. And I love the fact that I work at school because I still get the time off, which means I get to spend a lot more time with my family and see my little cousins. Um, so I think mostly that, that's like my family make it special for me. And everyone getting together 
and like having to sit around the dining table <laughs> it's like we never sit in the dining room at my parents house unless it's like someone's birthday or um like christmas so i really i don't know why i like sitting at the dining room table so much but it's just really nice to be with everyone and it's like that one day a year that you look forward to and it's you know i get more excited about christmas during my birthday and like everyone shares Christmas, I think that's the best thing about it for me, like everyone shares this one day, not everyone, it's different religions don't celebrate it, but you get the drift, you know, just, I don't know, that word, and um, I just think it's nice that everyone gets together and everybody celebrates it, and like, everyone messages each other like Merry Christmas, it's really nice that everyone's thinking of each other on that day, um, and also there's like obviously like the religious side to it as well, with Jesus being born. It's really nice that there's people are celebrating like being with their family and like the birth of Christ and stuff. I think it's a really nice day. I'm just gonna ramble on like for ages about this question, <laughs> so I'll finish here. Um thank you for watching. Um please do this video if you want to and put it in the response box, that'd be really nice. Because I would like to watch yours and i will see you in a video next week because i will do some more most likely on monday see you guys bye